Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we'll see this sum in Engineering Drawing, December 2, 2017-18 paper, Isometric. Front view and side view is given. If you see, there are three parts, one, two, three in front view, and in side view we have a slope. So I'm writing one, two, and three, right? And this slope we have. So first we'll start with this part one. So I will take height 25. First I will draw length, width, and height. Length is 55 plus 50, 105. Height is 25 plus 55, 80. And width is 56. So you mark 25 and you draw a line like this. So we are done with part 1. If you see front view of part 1. Then if you see the same thing is going behind. So I will take this part behind. How much behind? 56. Now we here this distance is 15 15 so I will mark 15 from here and 15 from here after that we need to draw that dovetail slot so I will go up by 10 and I will draw that line now if you see this this is slope right inclined surface so we need to draw it outside and then we need to transfer linear distance so draw it outside, you mark distance 15, 26 and 15, height you take 10 and you take angle 60 degree. You see height you take 10 and you take angle 60 degree. You take 60, 60 on both the sides. This is how you will get. After that. You take midpoint and we need to find distance x so i'll mark distance x which i need to project in isometric which i need to do it in this box so i will take midpoint i will draw a vertical line Then I will take X and I will cut on both the sides. So what I have done, I have transferred that angular distance into linear distance. Remember that. So we are done with this dovetail part. After that, we need to draw this slope. So remember that whenever you have a slope, you draw slope first. And even if you see there is one line in between that slope, but first you will draw slope, then you mark 55, draw vertical line, and again you draw line. Now this part, 12, 15, 12. So I will take midpoint and I will take 7.5, 7.5. And then I will take 12, 12. Here down also I will take midpoint and I will take 7.5, 7.5. Then you join. See this. This part and this part. You join this slope and this way. See this you can see inside view this entire slope see this so we are done with this part now what we need to do we need to give width so I will go down no, I don't know where to stop so what I will do I will draw a line from here so wherever it will intersect that will be the point so that point I will join over here see this slope for that so we got that part inside view same thing is on the other side and now we'll take this line down we will get the other part also that 12 mm see it is on both the side and this part 
so this way we are done with this sum and this line so i hope you people have understood this if you see carefully we have done part 1 2 and 3 see this this is side view 12 12 parts the slope part and this 1 2 and 3 this is 3 this is 2 and this is 1 so i hope you people have understood this thank you